Just a big storm. Hey, I've read this one before, but it's thunderstorm season, so I thought we'd read it again. Please, reach sound, click like, and subscribe to our channel. Yikes! That is a big storm. A storm was coming! We saw dark clouds and lightning in the distance. Let's check the weather channel, said Mom. The weather critter said a big storm with lightning, rain, and hail will pass right over Critterville. We better get ready for anything, Dad said. We might lose power. Dad checked all the flashlights. Oh, look, the little spider and mouse are on all the pictures. Did you see them earlier? Little sister and I got water in buckets for the toilet. Oh, that's a good idea, isn't it? We put up a sign that read, remember, pour water in tank before flushing. <laughs> and don't let the doggy drink it. We filled up pots at the sink for drinking water. We put a sign on the fridge, do not open. Why would you do that, do you think, huh? Then we rescued stuff from our yard. The wind began to blow. It blew harder and harder. It began to rain, too. I saw our neighbor's garbage can fly right past our window. Whoosh! Suddenly, the power went out. It was getting dark, and we couldn't turn on a light. I bet the TV didn't work either, or the computers. Mom and Dad got out our battery-powered lanterns, and everyone had their very own flashlight. The wind was cold, so Dad built a fire in the wood stove. We made knots out of newspaper to start the fire. We found an old phone in the closet and plugged it into the wall. Did you know that old phones work sometimes when you have no power? Mm, that's probably not true anymore, but maybe, who knows? <laughs> I called some of my friends. They didn't have any power either. I asked Mom and Dad if I could have everyone come over for a sleepover. Mom and Dad said no. That didn't seem fair at all. <laughs> oh, look. Look at the mouse and the spider in the first picture. They're under an umbrella hiding from the light. <laughs> it's like they're at the beach. <laughs> we baked potatoes in the wood stove and made grilled cheese with a pie iron. I was careful and didn't touch the hot stove. We played board games by lantern light. This is just like camping, I said. We got sleeping bags and all slept on the living room floor. Dad told ghost stories. There was lots of thunder and lightning. I wasn't scared. I snuggled real close to Mom, just in case. We couldn't sleep. Mom read a book to us. Dad fell asleep first. When we woke up, our power was back on. I saw the power company critters working on the electrical poles. That was neat. Yeah, those electrical workers, they, they have it tough when it storms. Those guys really do work hard. We really should appreciate them, huh? I was sad that it was all over, but Mom and Dad were happy. They said they wanted to take showers. Why would they want to do that? Our phone rang. It was Grandma and Grandpa. They were worried about us. Grandma, it wasn't so bad, I said. It was just a big storm. And the sign over the door says, Bless this mess. <laughs> well, I hope you like that little critter book. Oh, and I hope you don't get hit by storms that make garbage cans fly past your house. But if you do, just try and stay calm, sit close to mom and dad, and uh, remember this too shall pass. Thanks so much for listening. I love you guys. As Tigger says, ta-ta for now. <laughs>